All right, y'all, we're going to make this simple. I got nuggets, okay, y'all? And I got that ghost pepper sauce. I actually got a potato in here, too. But I'm not going to eat the potato now. Because mm, it doesn't really need to be doctored up. And I can't do that now. I just can't doctor it up right now the way I, I need to. It, it takes a lot. Because <clears throat> I got to take the potato skins off, put butter, real butter on here, all of that. It's a lot. No. Not right now. So, I'm just going to... Do the ghost pepper, ghost pepper sauce and honey mustard sauce. I got both, but I'm I'm kind of I'm kind of curious about the, the ghost pepper sauce because I don't think I have it before. All right. So what I did, I just got regular the regular nuggets. Okay, I didn't get them spicy because uh, this might be spicy enough. Okay, and I don't want to burn my my uh, my ass up. Okay, so let me go throw these in the microwave, y'all. I'll be back. Okay, y'all. I'm leaning, lean in, lean out a little bit. You know, nothing too tough. Ooh. So, yeah, this, this is the ghost pepper sauce, and I'm going to try it. Let me know if y'all have tried this already. Let me know if y'all think it's hot. This is... This is ranch, though. Oh, it's ghost pepper ranch? Yeah, look, ranch. It smell like regular ranch to me. Let's check it out. Burn y'all asses up first. Hope it don't drip. Drip, drip. was just itching anyway because it's not even that hot. It's really not. Mm -mm. I mean, it's fine, you know. It ain't bad. It's not nasty. It's not real spicy. It's got a little kick to it, but I like it. I like it. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. <clears throat> Going down though. I kind of feel it right there, though, a little bit, a little bit, right there, I feel it <clears throat> going down. I do. Got some kick to it. It's good. Anyway, this morning I was talking with Uncle Roach, and Roach was telling me that people that have been fully vaccinated still catching the virus. He's telling me that the numbers are going back up. And stuff y'all see i don't know all this because i don't watch the news like that i just don't it's depressing i've talked about it before i just don't do the news like that but mm, scary to hear that people that have been fully vaccinated are still catching the virus, see. <sighs> Ain't that defeating the damn purpose of, <laughs> of getting the shit and see that is why so many people, including myself, didn't want to get it. You know, that's why. That's why. Ain't even worth it. It ain't even working. So that's a scary thought. Is I think that's giving people false, um, a false sense of security. 
you know, as far as the, the virus, making people let their guards down um, when they really probably shouldn't, you know. Mm -hmm. I got alcohol, y'all, yeah. and I keep it still everywhere. Don't keep it. Don't play no games, y'all. I know this is like, like um, disinfectant, all purpose, cleaning bottle, but it's alcohol in here. I had this bottle since my old apartment in Milwaukee. Same bottle. Mm hmm. In my car, in the back, I'm in the back seat on the floor. I got bags of peroxide and alcohol, y'all. I ain't running out still. But it just really tripped me out. You know, I didn't know that the numbers was back on the rise. I didn't know. That Uncle Roach told me today. Good episode, y'all. I'm watching uh, Andy Griffin, y'all. Mm -hmm. You know, I hadn't got that shot, but I started to consider, you know, getting it because I wanted to do some traveling and they're starting to put the restrictions on people. Like, if you don't have the shot, you can't, you know, travel and stuff. They always find a way to try to make you or force you to do shit. Which is not cool, but... Mm. For the people that stood their ground, honey, you better keep standing it. I'm glad I can do it. Mm -mm. Find out more about it. At least find out if the damn... Shots gonna work, and so far, <laughs> mm -mm. no, no. Scary idea, scary thought. I didn't know shit was back on the rise though. I lost two of my lashes out of this eye yesterday. I didn't. I didn't call her or say anything, but I'm just saying I did. Mm. So I'm gonna wait to see if I lost any more today. I didn't so far, but still. I'm sitting out next door. Mm -hmm. Watch me make a video, y'all. That potato gonna be good by the time I hook it up, though. Mm -hmm. Anyway. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm not gonna even bring it up. Then again, I am going to bring it up, y'all. Because I know my mother better than anybody, okay? Can't nobody say nothing about her. I can't, know. And my mother just, she called me today and, and just, y'all, she just said something that it just didn't make any sense to me. Now, I'm just going to put it out there, y'all. The way she brought it to me, okay? Now, I'm going to let y'all break it up, break it down, however y'all want to. And tell me what y'all think, okay? <clears throat> My mother's birthday is coming up in December. And she decided to come here to Florida. You know, to visit me or whatever. Hang out. You know. And stuff, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Wait on this. Here we go 
gonna get with the drink, y'all. Woo! That was good, okay. All right, anyway. <laughs> anyway, she called me and asked me. Well, first off, she said that she want to have a party in Milwaukee with her family. I told her to do that. Have a party. Okay. <laughs> This lady said, but she want all her family there. Now, I'm the only one who's all the way here, guys, okay? This lady wanted me to catch a flight there to Milwaukee to go to her party and turn around and come back the very next day, guys. She wanted to come back to Florida the next day, and she wanted me to come back with her the next day. That's it right there, guys. So, let me know what y'all think about that. What do you think about that? I mean, I, I said, Mom, <laughs> the only person that's inconvenienced in a lot of ways, okay, is me. Your whole family's already in Milwaukee and everybody knows that. I'm the only one that's here. Why would I take a flight there? A place that I don't like. That's why I left. To go to a party and, and you're coming here the next day. I, somebody make that make sense because no, <laughs> it, it, it ain't computer here. Now I call my Ouija. Okay. Broke it down just like I just broke it down to y'all. Same way. Ouija was like, what? Thank you. Thank you. Y'all have no idea. <laughs> None. Now this lady just sat up and thought about this and I know her. I don't understand why. I, I never will. I'll never understand why. Never. But when she's coming here the very next day, why not go ahead and have the party with the family there in Milwaukee and then just come on to see her daughter and stay with her daughter and let her daughter treat her, you know. Once she get here, like we planned, you know, I got her her own little floaty, guys. I already got it. You know, I got her own little sheet set and stuff, you know, just... I even got her dresses, y'all. I done sent this lady dresses that I have waiting for her. Brand new dresses, y'all. Beach dresses. A beachy, pretty. It's like, it's just never enough, you know. Um, it's, it's like I, I just can't do enough, you know. I be trying, trying to let her know that mama i got your back if you need anything if you need any money if you need anything mama let me know okay if i don't have it we she do okay I, my niece holds thousands of dollars for me i've talked about it before i send her money every month like and not to mention the money that i have you know in my accounts here and in milwaukee still so, I told my mama that. So, I just don't understand, y'all, you know, why she just can't come here and let me treat her for her birthday. I don't get it. You know, to be honest, I want it to be that way. Just me and her spending time together. I really don't want nobody else to be a part of it, to be honest. Now, if that's being selfish, I'll be that, okay? But I really wanted my mama to myself. They can have her anytime. You know, she lives there with them. So, please, y'all, give me y'all feedback. Go ahead on, please. Give me y'all feedback on this one. Um, because I just got a feeling, because I know my mama, I got a feeling that she gonna somehow make a video 
and try to be the the victim and say how she suggested and how she's going to make it sound so nice on how she suggested this to me and how I flipped all out. I know her, y'all. <laughs> I just do. I know her. So y'all watch, if any of y'all out there watch Queen D, because that's her channel, go subscribe to her channel, guys. And she's mentioned something like that, y'all. Please come back and let me know, because I just know her. Because I know she didn't think of that whole concoction for nothing. Because she clearly know that the only person, like I said, is that's being inconvenienced is me. Nobody else. <laughs> Absolutely nobody else. So... Make it make sense, y'all. Please leave some comments. Okay? All right. <laughs> With that being said, I'm done. Y'all know I don't eat too much. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. Like, share, comment, subscribe to the video.